prices on the secondary ticket market touching $1,200 a little earlier today. In the Verde and Black, it is the host, Austin. One place and nine points behind LAFC. Just over half an hour played in the battle of the top two in the West. A night of heightened tensions. For goodness! A night of heightened skills too! Josh Wolf has got a lot of juice out of every single squeeze in this roster. And that includes Diego Fagundes, who is in the abyss in New England. Has come here, been a fan favorite, has worked his tail off, and has come up with big goals in big moments. The biggest game in Austin FC's history. The same person that scored the first goal in Austin FC history. When they're at their best, there's an urgency in possession. And there's not sloppy giveaways like that. For goodness. Beyond Segura. It's a Ruti. He needed the helping hand. What a ball this is from Diego Fagundes. Possession with no real pressure on them. But to see this run and to use the outside of his right foot and to put it in pace for Rudy to take a touch and have a hit. In a few moments, Diego Fagundes put... Gallagher. Opening up a little for the Irishman. Leaders of MLS's Western Conference. And indeed of the Supporters' Shield race. Philadelphia from the East will be amongst those hoping that this scoreline holds and becomes a result. The Windows this time chips it. Put down and away by Bale. Nick Lima. And directed up and in. And it's two for Austin. Maxi Aruti, who is having one of the seasons of his career. Not always the most prolific, but when you need him most, he's there to deliver. He's got a great motor, a great engine. His energy is contagious. And yet he has scored goals throughout his entire career. Certain moments, when to speak, what to, what to speak, how to do it. So this is extremely interesting from an LAFC perspective with a new head coach and Steve Torundolo, how he handles all this. Oh, it's broken to a routine. It's Austin's night, all right. Two for Ruti in the space of three minutes. And three glorious goals for Austin. Remember the free kick from Fragunas. Bad giveaway from Mario. Segura loses. Triussi brings him down. Yellow card. But how does Hollingshead and Segura not win this ball? And a Rudy again on the front foot, testing every single nerve of your defense and whether or not you can stop him. It's relentless for 90 minutes, and he's rewarded for seeing the play out with his second one in the second half. Austin playing LAFC off the field. Yeah, you know, this is another wake-up call for this LAFC team. This... Here's Ring. We'll come back to you, Ben, in a second. Alex Ring. Fagundes. Austin. Three goals to the good and eager for more. This is Driussi with a lovely turn and a fabulous goal. That golden touch emerges again for the 19th time in an extraordinary season. And it may well take the Argentine all the way to the golden boot and maybe to becoming MVP. He's completely changed every single player around him. This will be the 10th straight game that he's had a goal contribution the front runner for mvp and my word austin has put on a show tonight in front of a standout sold out crowd in texas lafc a poku Collins head to the left with Escobar on the right, it's a Poku and Cifuentes, and it's one back. 
immediate dividends from a triple substitution. 4 1. Yeah, any surprise who it is, by the way? Christian Arango. Felt like he was brought down there, but staying alive because Stuper came up with a great reaction save on Safuentes. But Arango's down on the ground. Look at that quick reaction. Goal scorer's goal. Half a chance, half a yard. Give him one. The ball ends up in the back of the net. Looked over the top for Arango. The goalkeeper is way off his line and backpedaling. Chicho Arango for LAFC. Well, he's appealing there that he was held back and should be getting a penalty. He is whether or not the defender pulls the left arm of Arango as he goes to strike this ball. But right here, no. Nope, not enough for me. No. Gabrielson just pulls him a little bit, but... Like a hunted down by Arango. Not giving this one up. Chicho Arango. Fagundes. Oh, it's another great header goal. It's a decent leap this time by Crepo to deny Driussi. I mean, the most remarkable thing of watching Driussi is his ability to just pop up in different ways. We've seen him score goals from 30 yards. We've seen him score goals. Arango to Cifuentes. Trejo! And yet, that's going to come from a stadium that's not half empty or anything like that, but there are considerable number of empty seats, which is a shame. Poku, chance for 4-2. The cap to the LAFC scouting department, because this player, 21 years of age, has taken every opportunity he's been given with. It's the finest night in Austin FC's Major League Soccer life so far. By a margin, they've taken down the leaders, not just tripped them up, but scythed them down.